No, little German boy, don't go to the county fair. Oh my God, I already feel so utterly clogging. No one understands me. All right, stop. Eight billion alive people, 15,000 years of human history. Someone has felt what you're feeling. Just stop it. Gentle reminder that often creativity decides to hibernate for a bit. It's okay. You're not broken. You're resting. And much like spring, creativity comes back. I needed to read this today. Wait, is that Will Wheaton? Love to cause situations. Hate to be near them, really. Undiagnosable. Um, butterflies when they flap their wings. <laughs> of course you have pro hair and blue nouns. One can't decide whether to join the Bards College or the Thieves Guild. Hmm. One will just have to weigh the pros and the cons. Perceive a grammatical gender of countries' names in Croatian language. <sighs> Splatoon Mega Turf War! My laptop wasn't working, so I yelled Christo at it, and the screen immediately turned black. I'm performing an exorcism now. Is that... is that silly string? It's not silly string if it's a very serious matter. Hmm. Serious string. I am a goddamn innovator. My jug of Arizona tea had a hole in the bottom, so I poured it into an empty milk jug because they're both gallons, and my intellectual mind had deduced that it would fit, and it fits. So I have been informed that a gallon of any liquid will fit into any gallon container, so I am not, in fact, a genius. Mm. So the shower perch fell off the wall today, and Mia got a bit more water than she bargained for. Mia would like the internet to know that she is now warm and dry. Oh my god, look at her. Generalized anxiety disorder is kind of a funny diagnosis. Like, this bitch is just scared in general. <laughs> I hate it. You have not experienced true fear until a poster falls down in the middle of the night. Yeah, one time I thought a poster had fallen down in the middle of the night, but when I turned on my light, it was actually a possum that fell through the ceiling into my room. So that's actually true fear. Oh. Get asked, idiot. Get answered, idiot. Get replied, idiot. Get screenshotted, idiot. Get reblogged, idiot. Get tagged, idiot. Get peer reviewed, idiots. Image description. One, a screenshot of a reply that reads, get replied, idiot. Two, a screenshot of Tumblr tags reading, hashtag get tagged, idiot, slash NID. Get image described, idiot. Get polled, idiot. Get cued, idiot. This reads like a World Heritage Post. <clears throat> if I may add, Get voiced, idiot! I want more overgrown ruins to explore, and if I have to make them myself, then so be it! This makes you picture someone aggressively planting vines around a family dollar that closed down two weeks ago. The older I get, the more dog I become. Obsessed with being given affection and being told I'm doing a good job. Losing my damn mind every time I get to go for a nice walk. You're terrified of the doorbell. You think being gay is hard? Try telling people you're only attracted to clowns. You know, narcissism ain't cute, sis. <laughs> Yesterday, I bought and downloaded the Stanley Parable, and then my power went out for the rest of the day. God himself didn't want me to play the Stanley Parable. <gasps> God is the narrator. So my working theory is that reincarnation is real, and that's why everything is so fucked up. We got too many people on Earth and their souls were supposed to spend a few more cycles as endangered animals or something, but we fucked the environment and got overpopulated. So we get guys who were supposed to be like black-footed ferrets or whatever till their soul reached maturity, but instead they're like influencers and politicians. This is also why furries exist. Yeah, I'll go ahead and integrate that into my belief system. Hey, PM, why are your characters ugly? Because they ain't catered to you, obviously. Like, literally, what the fuck are Anon's tastes? Your character's far from ugly as it gets. You know, because they are Anon. I'm a clown on them. They likely prefer the characters from Control-Alt-Delete. What a loss of taste.